The following day, he addresses the Judeans, Gohenom, nobles, officials, or anyone who would be responsible for the recreation. You see what a sad state we are in, how Yerushalayim lies in ruins with its gates burned up. Come, let us rebuild the wall of Yerushalayim so that we won't continue in disgrace. In response to this and him telling them what the king has said, they told him, let's start building at once. When Sanibal and Tobia mocks them for rebuilding, Nehemiah informs them that they have no share, right, or history to commemorate in Yerushalayim. The Kohen Hagadol and the Kohenam rebuild the Sheep Gate. The men from Jericho and Zakur ben Ari build its wall between the Tower of the Hundred and the Tower of Hananal. After its completion, the Kohenam consecrated it. The sons of Hashana rebuilt the fish gate with its timber framework doors, bolts, and bars. Alongside them were crews that made repairs. Beyond them were other crews. There were crews that made repairs to the old city gate with its timber frameworks, doors, bolts, and bars. Alongside them were crews that made repairs to renovate Yerushalayim and other repairs that were attached to the defenses of the city. And the renovation of Yerushalayim was as far as, as the broad wall. There were other repair crews working on the, on the wall opposite of a certain citizen's house. There were crews that made repairs on another section and on the tower of the ovens. Alongside them, one of the city's commissioners and his daughters made repairs. There were repairs done to the valley gate with its timber framework, doors, bolts, and bars, and they rebuilt 1,500 feet of the wall until they reached the Dung Gate. This gate was rebuilt with its doors bolts and bars by the crew of Malkiah bin Rehab. Another city commissioner and his crews rebuilt and covered the fountain gate with its doors, bolts, and bars. And they rebuilt the wall of the pool of Shalom up to the stairs that connected the royal garden to the city of David. Uh, commissioner Kenya bin Asbuk rebuilt the opposite wall from the tombs of David and his heirs up to the artificial pool and the soldiers' barracks. While the Levium made repairs, other commissioners made repairs to their districts. Alongside them were crews who made repairs to the wall opposite of the ascent to the armory at the angle. The crews that worked on the repairs between the angle and the house of the Kohen Hagadol were led by Bakruk ben Zakay. On the other side of the house of the Kohen Hagadol is where Cruz began at his house and the Gohenom from the plain and Cruz from Benjamin made repairs. There were repairs made from the house of Azariah to the angle and to the corner. While the Cruz working near the angle and the upper tower of the royal palace near the courtyard were working. There were crews that made repairs to the water gate to the, and to its east and the tower that projects out. The men from 
the car repaired the wall between the great tower and that projects out and the wall of the of hill at the horse gate every Cohen made repairs to the portion of the wall opposite his own house there were repairs between the house of the temple servants and the merchants adjacent to the mustering gate and the upper room near the sheep gate that were made. While these construction sites were going on, Cenobalt and Tobia carried on their harassment. They jeered as the wall was built up to an average of 19 feet and 80 inches, or half the total height of the wall. As the wall was joined together, Nikemia prayed that the actions of the enemies would be turned back upon them and that they would be exiled.